Welcome back to Whiskey and Waffles, everyone. What the hell are you doing here? I've returned from the negative zone, bearing gifts. Where the hell have you been? From our childhood. No, really, where the hell have you been for the last eight months? Marty, where we're going, we don't need roads. Well, JC, I'm sure you're wondering... What You're do we have here? We have what, what do we have here? Did you used to collect cards as a kid? Yeah, Marvel I'm a, cards. I'm a nerd. Yes. Yeah, yeah. we yeah. all did. And this is something I think it's very important to hold on to your childhood, especially as young professional adults rolling in the YouTube money. We should spend that money on cards from our youth. Did you go like go on another channel that you're rolling in YouTube money? Because we're not. I bought these on credit. So please, please watch and share this video so we can afford to have done this. Uh, so what I thought we would do, uh, and you know, you know, get some of our friends, get a bunch of other people, ourselves together, and let's crack open some nostalgia. Uh, you know, these are cards that we remember as kids. These are cards that we used to collect. Some of these cards I actually had stolen from me from a maid. We'll get to that story when we get to that story. Uh, but, you know... It was a weird childhood. It yeah. was a very weird childhood. Yeah. So, no better time than now to start cracking these. And for the very first episode, I thought, let's go to the one card set that I know for a fact I collected to completion. Yep. Did you as well? I did. Skybox, a company that is no longer in business. No, see, the video game... Not video game, the uh, trading card companies... Very incestuous over the years. I think Fleer bought Skybox. Skybox bought uh, some other company that originally did this stuff. It's and just... now Tops and, Sky and Fleer are the only two left. Uh, Upper Deck. Upper Deck would be the yeah, other Yeah, but they make that Marvel yeah. Legends so, game, which sucks. There's seven companies yeah. that all bought each other. Very incestuous, very fun. Uh, but yeah, so this is Marvel Universe Series 4. Uh, I don't know if anyone remembers this one. This was the first year that they did the all nine cards on a page was sort of a mural. I just want to point out you said incest was fun. Incest was fun. I didn't say, I said incestuous fun. But if you want to have heard that as incest is fun, that's your brain. So let's open up in this box. Let's open this box. Let's do it. All right, oh man, just looking at this. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. I'm so happy you're back. This is great memories. All right, so this is, I, as a kid, I never got, oh yeah, turn that on. As a kid, I never got the full box of these. I don't know about you, my mom was too cheap. I love you, mom. Buy me a full box, I only got like one or two at a time. With the exception of the first set, I always got a full box. Yeah. Sorry, good for you, so. All right, let's uh, open this up. And one of the most important things when you're unboxing, and other unboxers don't do this on YouTube, and I feel like they are bad people for it. They don't set up the display. I mean, the way they should. But let's, I mean, that's let's, how... let's be clear too. Look at the packs and who was chosen at the time. That really tells you where Marvel was. Spider-Man, Daredevil, Silver Sable, and Deathlock. Spider-Man, Daredevil, Silver Sable, yeah. and Deathlock. Wow. That is a very intriguing set of choices. Right? That's the Marvel Universe. That's what's relevant. Not Wolverine, yeah. not Iron Man. She... She's so irrelevant, it's not even funny. Uh, well, you know, at least uh, Mr. Deathlock is relevant these days. Nope. Yeah? Nope. There we go. There we go. Yeah. There we go. That's aiming. He's, uh, he was from Marvel Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. Season 1. Alright, so these are our cards. We're going to un un unpack a few of these, really go through them, uh, sort of card by card, get a sense of what's in these packs, um, and then we'll just sort of have some fun. Sort of romp through our childhood. Oh, this is, okay, so the inserts in here, mm -hmm. uh, Marvel 2099, 1 in 10. Gotcha. And then the Spider-Man versus Venom card is 1 in uh, 180. Oh, that's the one we, that's, yeah, yeah it's a uh, that's hologram. That's the expensive yeah. one. Yeah. Uh, it's two whole dollars all by itself on the internet. Uh, and then, yeah, so there's very limited chase cards in this set. The uh, 2099s are the main chase cards, and it's a set of nine red uh, variant cards that are all about the Marvel 2099 characters. It's pretty uh, lackluster. I'd be cool with a Spider-Man 2099 out of there, but not uh, not really much else. So let's see what we got first pack. Uh, that would be Rage, Rage of the New Warriors. Yes, very 
Venom. Ooh, Venom out of the Spider-Man set. Punisher versus Jigsaw. That is relevant these days. Namor, when he was trying to be a badass by having stubble. That was the year where all of the water people had to have facial hair because who cares about the water and people? And then DC had to step it up by cutting off Aquaman's hand. She-Hulk. Because I still haven't ever given a shit. Uh, I don't mind She-Hulk. She's terrible in Marvel vs. Capcom, though. Bloodseed. Who the hell is Bloodseed? I'll research that yeah, while you're... read that. Ooh, Black Knight. I remember Black Knight. Oh, good. Bloodseed was in Bloodseed number one in 1993. Very The helpful. 90s were the worst part of comics. Bloodseed. What is Bloodseed? I also like that Dark Hawk and Evil Hawk, they, <laughs> they reversed them the way it should be and call that a famous God. battle. I wish, like... I wish I didn't know who Darkhawk was, so I could say who the hell is he, but I know who Darkhawk was. Uh, the Dune. The alien race. Uh, is it, oh, That's it's a race. The Badoon, not he is Badoon. From the home planet Mord and Death Watch. Who used to have a mask. Yeah, he did, didn't he? Yeah. All right, my turn. All right, yeah, open the pack. With the exception of Venom, your uh, your pack was... Sweet sauce. Yeah. A lot of obscure a 90s-ness. Black Rust Luster. A lot of 90s-ness. I really hope I get the whole... Uh, new Set. warriors. Ooh, Loki. We got Loki in his old badassery. Warlock. AKA, you... AKA Adam Warlock. You're definitely already. Oh yeah, you got the better pack so far. Okay. Uh, we're getting two of these. I'm taking this one home. <laughs> oh, that's from the Excalibur nine set. Phoenix page. Phoenix in the center, I believe. Yep. Nova. So new that's more of your new warriors. We're gonna get a full new warriors page. I could. Ooh, saber tooth. Crazy eye saber tooth though. That's from the. Uh, that's from the X Men page. I remember that one very well. Silver Surfer versus Morg. I... Morg, sure. We're probably going to be like a main character in Guardians of the Galaxy 3 or something. That's how Rhino. obscure they go. Doc that is, Samson. That is the craziest Doc Samson I've ever seen. Okay, um, my pack got a little bit weak towards the end. <laughs> no, no, no. No, this no, is, no King this of the is, Reboots. No, no, this is what we got to look at. This is what we're, looking at we're looking at this. All the cameras get to look at this. Right there. That is so 90s. There is nothing more 90s than Mr. Fantastic. With pouches. With a vest with pouches. And a belt with pouches. And let's see, there's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 visible pouches on Mr. Fantastic. Rob Liefeld just came. <laughs> God, it's so 90s, it's great. Alright, let's open a Daredevil pack. See oh. what we get. Oh, holy crap. There's something on the inside? Yeah, on, yeah, yeah. On the inside, it's... Well, this... This is the new iPhone works really oh. well for you. No, no, no. Yeah. So it tells you what the breakdown of the different abilities by their scores are. So yeah. If, you know, you look here, it says the score. It tells you what it means. Oh, Magic nice. of 1990s comics. This is a pre-internet zone. Not a lot of people knew what to look for. Uh, and there we get. All right. So here is the next pack. Oh my God! I got a checklist. Is it the back of the pack. Yep. That's Wait, nice. but that's the back. No, that's a that's a. Insert. Oh, nice. This is the. Fear Master, 2099, literally the first and uh, only time I've ever uh, been excited for the Fear Master. Cared about Fear Master. Oh. Yeah, wow. So there you go. That's the insert. First thing, it's one in ten packs. Whoopity doo, said no one ever. Uh, I guess 13 year old me was probably excited to get the one of those. The Unsolved Mysteries, the face of Doctor Doom. Despite the fact that we've seen his face a ton of times. Yeah, the, uh, yep. the minimally scarred face of Doctor Doom. Terror Inc. Yep. Death metal. God, the nineties were this terrible. Is, this is so nice. This that's is... that's Hercules. <laughs> oh my God, this is ninety as hell. All right, I like this. Wolverine versus Omega Red. This is from uh, the X Men, uh, adjectiveless X Men from uh, the Jim Lee era. That's one of the first things. Uh, the art is in Jim. X Men number four. Wow. Yeah. Right, good job, Wolverine. Right after Claremont said peace. The Rigelians, which they got rid of and haven't been in the comics since the 90s. And uh, a pretty badass Ghost Rider, though. I'll give them credit on that one. You know, Ghost Rider in the 90s was a legit character. I know Nicolas Cage kind of ruined everything. Ruined everything. Mm -hmm. and, then, uh, and then we get a good bishop. I really like the art on the X-Men page. I'm excited to get all of these guys. And then the checklist. And the checklist. Yay. Checklist. Checklist. Yeah. All right, so I'm just so excited about this. Uh, I haven't opened packs of Marvel cards in forever. Well, that's because with the exception of this one right here, they haven't made packs of Marvel cards. In no, there. they really have, though. Actually, really? the thing is, there's so many of them, and I think, you know, we'll go through 
the fun of these packs, and we'll see. Maybe we'll do some modern stuff too. But the modern stuff gets really weird. Inexpensive. Uh, inexpensive. Well, because there's like sketch cards. Cardiac. And wow. Autographs. They were just. There was some stuff going on back in the 90s. Ooh, ooh, the Fantastic Four versus the Secret Defenders. Also, that's not the Secret Defenders. That's the new Fantastic Four. No, but weren't they the Secret Defenders? Not with Spidey. Oh. Well, ooh, a duplicate card. Or, uh, Another duplicate card. Oh, yeah. So we're going Another into the awesomeness card. of the 90s where when you bought a pack of card, you would just Another get duplicate patches card. of the <laughs> same card. 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 Yeah, there you go. Well, we didn't get almost any duplicate cards, I think, for the first uh, three or four right. packs. And but then, everything was just grouped. And then in a row, about 13 duplicate cards. All right, let's open a couple more packs uh, wholesale. We'll show you each one, and then we'll just go sort of right through it. You know what I really loved? You don't want to get a duplicate right at the start. <laughs> Uh-oh. Well, it's not for me to decide that. It was the manufacturers. Compliments they... of Golden Apple Comics. <laughs> Do I know how to open these packs? No, I don't. The love that you're doing it in front of the camera just so you can, like, you know. Yeah, get that's it. I've, I've watched some unboxing videos, I've unpacking videos. Uh, Doctor Strange versus Dormammu. Not a duplicate, but Dormammu. a back. Dormammu. And then a regular Doctor Strange. Did we get a Dormammu? No, it's a Hobgoblin. You're uh, adding syllables. Hobgoblin. And then uh, Ghost Rider versus Blaze. Not even Johnny wow. Blaze. He no, got lazy. Just Blaze. Well, there's no room on that card. <laughs> that was good. And then the origin of Ghost Rider. How oh, many? This is... Yeah. This is odd packaging. Hardcore! I think that's a Ghost Rider villain, but uh, just looks like crap. It does look like the Ghost Rider set, so oh. I'm going to say that's possible. And then Dyke. Oh, God. I hate the 90s. <laughs> this is so 90s. I hate the 90s so much. Die cut! Oh my god, and, it, and it's die, like, I'm gonna cut you. And then Thunderstrike. I hope there's a real Thor in here, and this isn't just all we yeah. get. Yeah, but Dis discount Thor. Discount Thor. Yep. And then Spider-Man versus Cardiac, because, you know, you can't have more than just one Cardiac card in a set. Because that was, yeah. Oh, and then the Shi'ar, here you go. That's a legit race. Gladiator, Lalandra, being all in space. And then a yellow chick. Because a yellow chick. All right. Uh, and so this is from 94, which is the era of Spider-Man the Animated Series is going on, X-Men the Animated Series is going on, you know. We're shooting this in 3D, right? Uh, yes, well, I mean, everything is in 3D because it's the future. That's where I come from, there's 3D everywhere. All right. Demo, Demo Goblin. From uh, Maximum Carnage. Oh, of all the goblins. Ooh. Wolverine nice. versus Venom. Not bad. Tiger Shark. From Submariner number five, because I've totally read that. Uh, uh, and then Punisher, and I believe right over here, that's a that's a Dark Hawk's wings, your favorite. That does that does reminisce. Dark, Dark, Dark Angel from is that Jessica Alba from the page of gonna be garbage. This is Crystal of the uh, Inhumans, also Avengers. <laughs> X Force versus the Brotherhood. This is your stuff, Wally. Ooh. This is nineties. Purity oh, right this here. is this right here. No, no. Let's look at this for a second. This is that vintage Rob Liefeld X Force. So this is right after they were New Mutants. Uh, I remember this issue, and this is early too because their costumes uh, have pouches. Th there has less pouches yep. than they, they did in the future. But you got Shatterstar, Domino, Cannonball, Cable, uh, Warpath. Yep. Because Thunderbird was his brother. He died. Who died? And Boom Boom. And then uh, and Boom Boom was Boom Boom. Boom Boom. Oh, boom, boom. And then Wolfsbane. Yep, uh, she did. Uh, no, 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 not Wolfsbane. That's Feral. Both are dead right now. Well, no, I know, both are dead, but, but Wolfsbane Spoiler was, to five years ago. Uh, or is it Wolfsbane? Hold on, is there a listing? Yeah, probably. Uh, it's uh, one of them. And while you're figuring that out, we got the Asgardians, Lilith for our Ghost Rider page, and while you're your, your top choice. Ooh, that's pretty. I like that. Magni, that's in the center of that X-Men page that I'm so very fond of. This is what we're going to do. Hold on. I want to show the back of these cards for a second, too, because these are pretty great. Also, they chose Toad. I know. That's my one of my favorite parts of this. But I'm going to read this for you. To prove their good faith in, funnel, in tunneling... Why well, I can't read. Hold on. I'm going to read it close. <laughs> to prove their good faith to the tunneling Morlocks, the new Brotherhood of Evil Mutants agreed to destroy Cable's newly formed X-Force until, together with the, Mor with the Morlock, Morlock mask, 
The Brotherhood am- Stop you. fucking up the Brotherhood Brother- ambushed X Force and its own headquarters at its own headquarters, swiftly gaining the upper hand. But the tide soon turned when the dust had settled. Mask had been killed. Peace the Brotherhood out. retreated, but not before losing their own Sauron. Oh God, everyone's favorite Pterodon. Vampire Man, okay. and critically injuring X-Force's cannonball, with blood spilled on both sides. Okay. Their next battle is likely to be even more vicious than this one. Yeah. Thanos. Thanos! Oh, I'm just gonna start opening. Oh, okay, cool, let's just start it. Yeah. I'm, that, was, uh, that was a wall of text. Oh, although I do want to point out, famous battles, War Machine. <laughs> no verses, just, just War Machine. machine. He, he, he battled life. Lilith. Thing. All right. Galactus, that's actually a pretty badass one. Uh, this is the top Cent- of the... Center. No, oh, is it center? No, no, it's the, no, it's the top. I think it's the top. I'll, put, I'll bet that it's center. Yeah. You judge by the number, too. You see it? Good point. Yep. You know, yeah, it's center. You're right, center. Yep. Blurp, 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 center. Yep, 14, that's middle of the page. Shut up. God, I'm a nerd. All right, that is very nerdy of you. Spider-Man vs. Center, so six. This is good. Yep. I like that. Uh, Psylocke. Uh, also, and to go with... Oh, perfect. See, actually, we can show a little bit. Oh, no. Go, go down. There you go. Yeah, 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 yeah. They match. Yeah. yeah there right, you go. We'll keep this. Uh, and then, okay, everyone, this is probably the best card in the set. I just want everyone to know. It, it goes with your card. I know. It's the same page. No. Yeah. Yeah. Speedball! Look he at that. killed most of Stanford Connecticut. I know, but, but I, love, I love that Speedball's... Uh, Pose is sort of like, hey guys, look at my balls. Balls in my name. Look at my balls. And that the is, balls coming a, out of his ass. That, too. Is, that is, oh my god, he is literally pooping balls. That is the best. I love Speedball. He does look like a girl, though. Like if you look at his face, like she looks like she's having a lot of fun. When was Invisible Woman a hooker? <laughs> the nineties. Her the, clothes became invisible. Thirteen patches on Mister Fantastic, and then a boob window on Invisible Woman. Spider Woman though maintains Spider-Man? her dignity. Actually, that's a very nice Spider Woman. I like that artwork. Good Cable here. Cable shooting something because that's what Cable do. Hulk versus the leader. Um, the just leader so you know, if I pull the Venom versus Spider Man, I'm gonna get up and just walk out <laughs> without telling you. Origin of Cable. I uh, actually really like Origins. Also, no longer a mystery. Yes, but you know what I like about these Origin cards is you know actually give you a little info on the back. Oh, I was wrong. The uh, those wings earlier were actually uh, Falcon's edges oh. of his wing, because yeah. Darkhawk has no real wings. <laughs> he looks like a flying squirrel. Oh, all right. Another uh, one of my favorite characters back in this day, Cannonball. I actually used to draw Cannonballs mostly because I couldn't do legs, and uh, he doesn't have legs when he's flying. You just put some like <laughs> stuff underneath him, and he's good to go. But yeah. Cannonball. I like Who cannibals. the hell is Oculus? I know, that's what I did when... This guy, uh, little known fact about Oculus, uh, he got lost, lost in, in the, the rift. rift. Yeah, yep. right, we are the same person. Yep. That's Took disgusting. that joke. Uh, Micromax, no one cares about Micromax. I'm going to laugh because you're going to only have one and it's going to be destroyed and it'll just like ruin your set. That's true. Cyclops. Ooh, set that aside. I like I want those X-Men's. Well, you're keeping all of it anyway. Well, I know, but I just want to keep, I don't have to like go through all these a second thing. I want that gambit though. Where's no, but seriously, at? like there's a whole page I'm not gonna know who anybody is. It's like <laughs> it's the most random group. I think there, I think there's just a nineties page. I think that's what it is. Yeah, yeah, it's called it's like the, the Ovoids. <laughs> Marvel, like, when they rebooted the movie, Ooh. when they did the movie universe, they were just like, you know what? We're just going to ruin all these other races and just make the Chitauri a thing, well, which was good. Well, the Chitauri were, they had precedent. They were in the Ultimate Universe. Uh, but yeah, no, there's, that's the thing is, is you watch Guardians of the Galaxy, you watch all this modern, uh, you know, Marvel stuff that's getting Creed, that's getting all this stuff. Uh you know, there's a whole vastness of alien races. Now, you're never going to see the Shi'ar, because that's X-Men. Fox owns that. But there's so much more. We haven't even seen Skrulls yet. Like, there are going to be some crazy, crazy, crazy shit going on with Marvel movies coming up. All right, so uh, also, I really wanted to show this one with the origin of Nightcrawler, replete with a uh, crazy mob with pitchforks and flames in the background. I love that. All right, so... A personal favorite of mine, Spider-Man nice. versus Venom. Uh, and then also to continue your New Warriors page. Ooh, to go next to uh, Speedball, who's pooping balls. 
and everyone's favorite Marvel character, Motormouth. Who? Yeah, Motormouth. You know, Motormouth. Who? A scene, potentially, from the next uh, Captain America movie. Uh, Captain America vs. Crossbones. He was the dude bad guy. You know, he wasn't particularly... The guy from the elevator fight. Yeah, then he, yeah. he ended up being... He survived at he the had, end. He and, had the name. Yeah, that's yeah. a shark beast. I'm liking that beast. Yeah, uh, well, here's one of your... <gasps> One of your requested 13 gambits. Here, here. Thank you. Before you make uh, weird noises. Look at that. I love this art, man. So good. So good. Love that. Look at that. I had, I had so many of these. This was... I was a Gambit kid growing up. Still a big Gambit fan now. Look at that. Real name, Remy LeBeau. Affiliation, X-Men. Blue team. Because this is back when there were two teams of X-Men. Because they were so goddamn... You are nerding out so hard. Oh, let me put you off to the side. Ah, uh, and another product of the 90s. Sleepwalker. <laughs> who was actually in uh, yes. an issue of Fantastic Four like last week. Yeah, no. Sleepwalker's... Not to time this, sleep, but, yeah. Sleepwalker's gotten some play, though. He's, he's, he's no motor mouth. Let's be clear. Sleepwalker has never gotten play or gotten mm -hmm. anyone play. Uh, here's a fun 90s character that I actually unabashedly appreciate. Carnage. Who's still in the comics right Absolutely. now. Absolutely. He's one of the very fantasy. few that's still there. This is one of those things is, is people like like to give Carnage and a lot of the mid nineties Spider Man comics shit. But like only that's the, a like, smart only character. Only the clone saga stuff. Which is you know, it's sort of like the amazing Spider Man series of the Spider Man comics, you know? There's some good stuff in there, but on the whole people hate it and so they give it no shot. I remember back when I opened my originals, I thought Ooh. Hulk was great because it was like the number one card. And people were like, oh, number one special. And it's like, no, it isn't. You know what I really appreciate it's is the really fact not. that today we're getting the Marvel Cinematic Universe and not 94 we got the Marvel Cinematic Universe? Because then Marvel would be bankrupt and DC would be no, making the better movies. It's because we'd have to have freaking U.S. agent in the film. I mean, probably played by someone who's big in the night. This is like... Hey, um, Wally. What? Oh. Ho, 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 ho. Looks like someone got a big pull. Oh. Look at that. All right, you got a show. You got a show. So you're not going to be able to see on camera. That's the big hologram. One in 180 packs. Nice. Oh. That looks... So, oh, that comes out really nice. Thank you, iPhone. Yeah. No, that's that's beautiful, man. Child me would flip out if I knew I got this. So many packs. So many packs open as a kid. Never got that. So beautiful. This is your redemption. All right, that's awesome. All right, uh, do you have a card holder? Uh, no, I don't, because I don't collect cards anymore. Um, there we go. Cersei, this is um, Joffrey's mom before she became queen of uh, Westeros. Also, wasn't Cersei a member of Excalibur? <gasps> Whoop! You got the high value pull. I got another gambit. The worst part is you will display every gambit before you display that. I'm, I will. I will every gambit pulled during this nostalgia trip. I will very, very happily uh, display. Uh, man, nice pull. Rogue. Rogue. Nice. More of that X Men page that I'm so fond of. Ah, uh, uh, the '90s, because there was like Ghost Rider <laughs> and the Night Stalkers and the Darkhold Redeemers who had the Book of Darkhold, which meant nothing. More Rogue. But. More War Machine. Nice. Famous battle. Well, read the back of that. Is he actually battling anyone in yeah. particular? Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll read. Alright. Uh, Spider-Man versus Kingpin. Uh, Kingpin, who's more traditionally a Daredevil villain these days, uh, but in the 90s he was staunchly Spider-Man, at least for the non-comic book readers, because he was a huge part of the animated series. No, it the literally is the origin of War Machine. There's no battle. <laughs> I got one too. God, it's just well, he, his you life wanna, is about. Do you want to poorly read it while I continue to open? Blood Axe wants to. Uh, yeah, I'll poorly read it. Every time you screw up, I'm hitting you with the fly spot. Near death from a fatal nerve condition and besieged by enemies from all sides, millionaire industrialist Tony Stark, also known as superhero Iron Man. Wait, he's Iron Man? Spoiler. <laughs> created the most powerful suit of armor of all, War Machine. Donning his latest creation, the inventor was able to put an end to the threat posed by an elusive master of science and their employer, Justin Hammer. A master of science and their employer. Wow. Yes, silence. You can slap me with a thing. I messed up. After his body finally succumbed to the disease that gripped it, he was placed in cryogenic suspension. Stark arranged for, arranged for his best friend, Jim Rhodes, uh, <laughs> to receive the armor so that War Machine could live on beyond Stark's own lifetime. I like the movie Origins better. He just straight steals it. Iron Fist. 
Apocalypse. Ooh. Who looks kind of anorexic for Apocalypse standards. Does Goddess. That's nondescript. Uh, she was from Infinity, Infinity War. Yeah. Infinity War. Yeah. The, or, was it War or was it Crusade? Uh, it was just War. I think. It, I think. No, it she was, was Crusade because Infinity War was where everybody had the doubles. Oh, that's right. That's right. Everyone fought uh, stupid versions of themselves. And only Spider-Man survived. <laughs> God, the nineties were stupid. I don't know. The Infinity stuff's good. It's the namesake of the upcoming films, though. I just, I love Deadpool. Ooh, that's good. De that's back when Deadpool really hadn't established himself as the sort of wisecrack. He was still kind of badass a little bit. Uh, I mean, he was wisecracky. But... Why are you excited about that? I don't know. Oh no, because this is what I wanted to show. So we've had thirteen patches on Mister Fantastic Alpha Flight. Uh, we've had Invisible Woman with a four boob window. A really shitty Iron Man. That was Iron Man though before the movies. Also, like I said, really shitty. So, what does '90s thing look like to you? Uh, just the blue skivvies. He's wearing a helmet. And you wonder <laughs> why I say I hate the '90s. <laughs> it's the best. That makes no sense. Uh, Red Skull, nice. So I'm not gonna make a Nazi joke. I'm not gonna make a Nazi joke. The Wild Pack. Which had Sandman as a member. Wow. Yeah, that feels a little extra. Oh, good. Proper Thor. Not a... No, no, he doesn't even have the stupid beard or any of that crap. No, and he had a beard in that battles uh, one, too. Because Blood Axe. <laughs> Again, if you're going to do more... Uh, more cards than one with Blood Axe, you're in good shape. Uh, you listen... Nope. Basilisk. <laughs> Because 90s. <gasps> Ulysses Claw, or as he was known back then, just Claw. Uh, this is going to be a Age of Ultron villain, played by uh, uh, Gollum. The also, Night also Stalkers. Here, take Death Metal back. Oh, you don't want Death Metal? Night Stalkers. Punisher versus Thorn. Isn't that like a... That's gotta be a last name. A, isn't... Speaking of... I thought he was a Batman gangster. Speaking of Batman... Is, nope. Scarecrow. Nope, just just Thorn. But it happened in six issues Dead of Punisher War Zone. Six Sleep issues Walker. for this. <laughs> People bought this six times. Probably more than that. That probably wasn't the last issue. Oh, I know. Uh, Executioner song. This is great, actually great crossover. Really, really good. This is when uh, Cable and then Strife was kicking around and uh, Strife was a Cable clone. Cable being a son of... Infinity War. Ooh, yep. nice. Yep. Uh, and then a really sharp Havoc back in his X-Factor days. Uh, and then uh, Superman, right? That's Superman? Yeah, that's Superman. Superman. That's yeah. Dark Superman. Dark Superman. He goes by Proctor in the Marvel Universe. And Gamble. Because actually Proctor, the... Uh, Bumbling sidekick villain. Oh, good. And the, uh, and just to complete your uh, new warriors, it's Turbo. I think that does complete it, actually. I know. That's the worst part. The face of Darkhawk. What? What does it look like? I don't care. How many of the faces of uh, sort of things were happening in Marvel at this time? Uh, strong guy. I love me some strong guy. I don't know why he's on the Excalibur page. Uh, well, no, I think this this actually then is just all uh, excess X teams. Yeah. Because Havoc is on this page too. And oh yeah. It's very X Force. Yeah. And then Wildheart because yeah. that's. A Did character. a Psylocke also. I don't even know if that's a character. Oh, it's it's Alpha Flight. Yeah. Cable, oh, he used Cannibal, to be Wild Child. Really? Wait, wasn't Wild Child from uh, Age, Age of, of Apocalypse? Apocalypse? Which would which would post date this stuff? So that doesn't no. make sense. Well, there was probably an alternate version of them. Uh, you know, we were promised. I really want to point this out. Yeah. All right. So Hobgoblin, Again. Ghost Rider and Blaze, Origin of Ghost Rider, Hardcore, Die Cut, Thunderstrike, Spider-Man, Spider-Man, Cardiac. Oh, Nightcrawler! That's a nice Nightcrawler. The Shi'ar, Blaze, Cyclops. Wow, Wally, aren't you happy you got this? I am. You know what? I am just oozing uh, a nostalgia right now. This is really great. Uh, ooh, ooh, ooh. Yeah, we got two. We got a... <laughs> All right. Wow. So if we were going to get two 2099s... You suck at 2099. 
we were going to get Fear Master and then Specialist, who I believe was, was an X Men? No, uh, Spider Man. Uh, Spider Man, yeah. First appearance, Spider Man 29, number four. This is why I haven't had sex in five years, because I know that off the top of my head. Yeah, well, so it's actually funny. Uh, this is. Uh, this is actually depressing. Well, oh, yeah, on. no. Yeah, funny is not the right word for this. Uh, the red foil look for the 2099s. Uh, the 2099 line, all the first issues in that had foil borders. Yep, and Spider-Man was the red foil. Spider-Man Spider was the red foil. I remember X-Men was blue. But that was in the second group. Second second run. Yep. Yeah. Uh, Doom was green? silver. Silver? Hulk was green. Hulk was green. And then Ravage was gold. And was Ravage gold? Yeah, Ravage was gold. Ravage 2099. I actually had all the issues of that. Uh, there was... So what uh, was the fourth? Um, it was Doom, Spider-Man, Ravage, and what was the other one? Because Hulk was later... Hulk was later, X-Men was later. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. Maybe, was there... Punisher. Punisher 20... Yeah, that because that was like the that, one. And that was like a gun metal. Yeah. Um... So, yeah, so uh, the 2099 books, uh, Ravage, I actually had... Every uh, issue. I did have every issue. Which isn't that big a run. It's good. Strife. That's pretty good. Uh, Beta Ray Bill. I love that. Um, no, but so uh, we had uh, this pizza place that was sort of Chuck E. Cheese-ish. Maybe, maybe like a Shakey's Pizza. I don't know exactly right, what My it last was. pack sucked. I got two more, so here you can open one yeah. more. Uh, and then... Uh, Yay, not sucking pack. And then, uh, yeah, so they had, like, you could get a bunch of tickets, and there was a grouping of comic books that you could get out of there, and... That's actually the last one you needed for... Marita. For... Nice. New Warriors I didn't even realize she was around that early. Yeah. She's dead, too. Yeah. So, uh, so, yeah, so we have this place, and, uh, and, you know, after a certain number of tickets, you could, uh, you know, exchange them for this little pack of comics. And in the comics was basically like four straight consecutive issues of Ravage 2099. I think it was like two through uh, five. And so I read through it. I was seeked out number one, just to have the complete set. And then I think I read through till the end of it. Not really, no, I just thought it was cool. And it was one of the first things I had sort of all of because I was really little at the time. Um, and so I actually, let me ask you this question. I'm, I'm changing subjects here, John. Uh, what is the one. 90s character that we've not seen one of yet. Is it the one that's on the top of that pack? It's that the one that's yeah, but no one else has seen it. Well, he's been in some of the famous battles. He is, but Wolverine. I'm actually surprised that we didn't get one Wolverine in every pack. I thought that was sort of like no, no, that's Marvel Comics uh, two years ago. Oh, and then they, the secret of uh, Spider-Man's parents. Oh, the 90s. The techno wizards. Burn that entire page when we put it together. The Brood. Actually, this is a pretty good last pack. Because there's yeah. a lot of cards you haven't seen before. Yeah. Or yet. Archangel. Um, I didn't see a Jean Grey, so I don't think we finished our X-Men page with this plot. Moon Knight. Marvel's knockoff. Batman. Uh, Batman. Uh, Cobweb. This is like almost entirely... That's is basically a new pack. A new pack, yeah. That was a good last pack to have. Oh, good. Cobweb from Sleepwalker number four. <laughs> or number three. Good. All right, so uh, all told, I'm gonna call this a pretty, pretty good win of a box. Now, Not... now, Wally, how many YouTube views do we need to get to cover the cost of this box? Uh, to cover the cost of this box, we need. Uh, I'm gonna see what I could eBay that for. Just a couple million. I don't like that math. No. Really. Probably not good math. These aren't that bad. Actually, if you want a box of these Skybox cards, uh, Marvel Universe Series 4, uh, it's actually not 94, I said 94, there's 93, but all roughly the same time. Uh, you can actually go to Amazon and pick up a box yourself. They're actually not that expensive. We'll you can sell that for 40 bucks. Really? Yeah, that really? really a $40 card? 40 bucks. You really get a card that sort of paid for the whole box? That's not bad. All right, well, don't, no views. Don't, don't watch it then. You don't have to wa go watch something else. You don't have to be here. We paid for the box. Thirty-five dollar buy it now on e uh, yeah, eBay. Yeah, so perfect. We're good. So yeah, uh, breaking even. <laughs> hopefully, all the boxes will do that. So yeah, so we've got a. I mean, this was a lot of fun, and we got a few more boxes to open. Uh, we'll invite some of our friends uh, along to come, you know, run through this nostalgia trip with me. I'm really excited about the '94, the next series of the of the Marvel Universe. This is a great X Men one is one of my all-time favorites. The Spider-Man's great, the Masterpiece is great, 
The 71st. First edition. I know. I have no idea what that even yeah. means. I'm pretty sure there's only one edition. Yeah. So, uh, but yeah. So as I said before, you go to Amazon. Well, the link for you in the description. Yep. Uh, buy it through that link if you want to pick this up because of this. Because uh, we'll get a kickback. I mean, I'm just gonna be straight up with you. We yep. get a kickback. We get and a then kickbacks. I know we got this guy. But so here. Stop touching the front with your bare hands. Cards. Um, but you know what? For the karma of getting the one big cool pool, we got terrible other chase cards. Uh, hopefully, we'll have better luck in the other box. Uh, and, we didn't uh, even get the right number of insert cards for this box. No. Well, see, that's it. The odds are, you Not know, one in, in, one in ten. And but that 40, doesn't. But that, right? doesn't but that doesn't mean thirty-six. But that doesn't mean you get four or one out of every ten. That's just the odds. Some some boxes are more frequent. We just didn't have a lot of luck with this one. So, so yeah, so like, comment, subscribe. Um, you know, thank you for watching. Watch more of these unboxings. Let Watch us them. know what you want to see us sort of unbox next. Obviously, you we have what you see here, but we'll get more stuff. I, I think, did I did an unboxing too that you weren't there for. Uh, yeah. D DC Hero Clicks Trinity War unboxing. Perfect. We'll watch that yeah. uh, because it'll probably be uh, at least a week before the next one of these comes out, so you can watch that. Uh, and yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Let us know what you think in the comments. Nostalgia uh, porn abound. Let's just geek out over all these fun cards. Did you uh, just say that just so you could put porn in the, uh, I did. In the tags? We are going to get all the wrong views. <clears throat>